can you have? The cane was wrong. He left office when in 2009? Uh, and, and that was uh, nine began the uh, was the election. Yeah. So on 2009 you couldn't do it, but in 2010 under McDonald you could. Mm -hmm. So what does that say? And it and then he left that and he became the cheerleader for Obamacare for the economic recovery package, this <laughs> borrowing and bleeding that we're talking about. And we absolutely cannot permit him to uh, to continue to push this legislation, to vote for Obamacare, uh, to continue to vote for these economic policies. It's absolutely crucial that we work to promote the policies that will save this country, not the policies that will destroy this country. And people always say that the issues that are before us today are the most important in your lifetime. Well, now they are. Because the issue is your lifetime. The issue is that. For young people, okay, how you make less than $30,000 a year, how would you like to spend $750 of extra taxes to, because you don't have health insurance? You make $50,000 a year, your family. How would you like to spend $2,500 as a fine, a tax, for not having health insurance? You make $70,000 a year. How would you like to spend $3,500 extra in taxes? Obama says he's not going to raise taxes only on rich people above a quarter of a million. Well, he's just raising taxes by two and a half points on anybody that doesn't have health insurance or requiring them to buy health insurance and they have to spend 7 to 8% of their income before they get any government help in doing it. That's terrible financially. It's unfair to young people and to their families. But I'm talking about older people. I'm talking about our parents, uh, me. <laughs> I'm talking about people who are going to need medical care and do not want to have to only get the medical care when they don't need it. <laughs> they, want to, they want to be able to live decent, full lives all the way up until the time God tells them that it's time to return to him. And until that time, they want to be able to live this life. And they do not want the government to enter into that decision. Amen. It's their decision, their doctor's decision, and God's decision. So let's remember that those folks up there are not God. Thank you.